Hello and welcome back to Cranky Cast. So, I think we're about ready to infiltrate the fortress from one direction or another. If that's what we want to do, unless we're going to go back to the cave. Yeah, let's go check out the cave first. Why not? Why the f not, you know? Hmm, I spied something with my little eye. What's that? A claw hammer? A chest. How on earth do we get it, though? I don't know. Where is it? Well. Oh. Oh. The ornate oh, chest over there? Yeah, we have to like, go inside first and then go around, I think. I'm never going to remember that when we actually go in. <laughs> okay. I'll try to remember it, too, but I might not. Wits. Ah, I see where we are. Yeah. Oh, this side of those friggin' slugs. Yep. Ooh, a little camp. Gurgle, gurgle. What are they, freaking murlocs? <laughs> A tattered note. I've made it this far. Now there is only a little length of ground to cover. I hear them talking, these strange creatures. One is a royal, I believe. The others, her disciples. But from what I can tell, they've been locked down here a long time. My strategy is stealth. I'll sneak past them during one of the royal's more impassioned speeches. And they'll likely not even notice me. Home to Carvo, to Rusket, to my farm again. The end. Hmm. Oh. Um, Where is so yeah, it does look like you could probably sneak past them while they're like padding away. I'm not even sure what we're here for, though. Oh, oh hey, it looks like I'm sorry. Bad, what? Well, that's what I was just wondering. Where, where's our goal? <laughs> where's our destination? I don't know. We're kind of just looking around here, aren't we? Yeah. Oh, no. Ah, uh, stop. 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 <laughs> You're right. <laughs> I accidentally uh, clicked far away and I just started running. And I had to come all the way back to stop myself. I guess this is like a little area of rock you can step on. I saw on the map, but I don't think there's anything here actually. All right, never mind. So there is like a little area beyond all this. Um, also, that's just like one fire slug, isn't it? Down below? Or yeah, there's next to like one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's also a charred corpse over there, which I'm guessing is the note writer. Yeah. We could take one fire slug for sure. Oh, there's yeah. another corpse. Yeah, assuming he doesn't just aggro all the rest of them to come over. I don't think he would. And if he does, we could just leave. <laughs> True. I was going to say, how are they trapped down here? But then I realized that they probably can't climb ladders, can they? <laughs> no. What are these little geyser things? Do you see them? Oh, the steam cloud removes burning. Oh, really? Huh. Let's head down here. 
Do we want to try and stealth past this guy, or do we want to just fight him? Um, I guess we could try stealthing. I'm not even going to. Okay. I'm just going to walk out here. If he sees me, he sees me. I've spotted something. Ooh. Ooh, a magical dwarven hammer. Really? Any good? It does more, well, similar damage, but it has 15% cleave damage. Oh. Is that two handed? One handed. Oh, nice. Although the one I currently have has plus one strength. Ah. And slightly more damage when you come in the air. Hard to give up. Well, you can sell it, I guess. <laughs> You'll have others. And I sent you 258 gold. Why? Because that's what was in there. Oh, thanks. <laughs> You're the one that buys everything anyway, so. Yeah, that's probably better. All right, I'm sick of hiding from this asshole. Got something to say, buddy? Okay, I'll take my leave. Oh, can I go past you? Are you chill? to get him around real fast. <laughs> so basically this just goes back to the area we were already in. Which, yeah, I'm not sure why we would want to go there anyway. Yeah, I'm not sure what we're supposed to do down here. There's got to be some reason for being in here. I just realized that there were vines up where we were on the other side that lead all the way down. Like we could have didn't have to go the way we thought we had to go past that big one. Um, it, does, it doesn't give me any like. Uh, no, I think we're too far away, though. Uh, but I think that is a, what, is that, what that is. That is what that is. Yeah, I mean, I don't really see any reason to fight these things, then. There has to be some reason for this cave. I mean, maybe it's just literally just, like, to get from one side to the other, if you don't happen to find... You think find... so? Yeah. But there's no reason to get to the other side. It's just right outside. You just walk there. Right, but like we went, we might not have found or done the proper things to get to the other guy that leads like into the jail cell and stuff like that, you know, and vice versa. We might never have. Well, I don't know. This this side seems a little pointless. <laughs> yeah. Not everywhere has to make sense, though. All right. So let's just. You know, we probably could get, like, some loot from the killing the the big slug in here, I'm, I'm assuming, but... Yeah, I don't know if we could take it on yet, though. Yeah. This one doesn't want to fight. I tried talking to it again, see if it would. Didn't want to. I don't really feel great about just attacking it for no reason. By the way, my cat's now sitting on my phone, which has the timer, so... I don't know Very how long nice. this video will be. <laughs> <laughs> and you can't move it, certainly. It's too heavy of a cat. Yeah. So I guess we're going back to the fort, right? Yeah. Nowhere else to go. Nothing else to do. Well, we do have another way from the dungeon to that door. I'm looking through our quest real fast. Okay. Okay. 
Is it the ones that are green that are currently active or oh, you can crap. check mark at the bottom? Uncheck rather. <laughs> well, they're all active, it seems. What the hell? Like, yeah, we have some that are obviously done, like the imprisoned elf I still have. Do you have that one? Mm-hmm. Like, we did that one. That one was complete. We talked about how we freed him to her, and we got, like, a reward for it and everything like that. Why is that still an active quest? Uh, we can manually set it to inactive on the right side there. Yeah, but I feel like it should be inactive now. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, the rest of these are all fine. Oh, wait, that one says closed. Hmm. Wait, I just checkmarked it again and it finished some stuff. Weird. Okay. And we never did check into the arena either, so. Right. Now, I, I, I'm going to pop in real quick because this quest should be finished now. Just up. talk to her real fast. Let's say Halo. Yeah, I and mean, there's not even anything we could say to her. It's done. Amaro doesn't have anything either. So I don't get why that quest is still sticking around. Hey, buddy, you want a Dwarven Hammer? You talking to me or the guard? Guard! <laughs> <laughs> Medicine. What a shame. All you need is a strong constitution and the gods will take care of the rest. All right, to the fort. To the fort! I don't see anything else worth waiting around here for. No. Don't tell anyone where you got this. Okay. Careful. Magisters now might might not like you being up here. Got something over here anyway. I'm not exactly sure what they can see. No, it doesn't look like they can see me here anyway. All right, anyway. You know there is Shall a ladder we? going down into that. Yeah, I saw area. that. I can see, if you hold shift, you can see what they can see, and they don't, they don't see up here, but the area is still red. I'm not sure, like, what divides the area mm -hmm. like that. But we can go in this door. Swish. The Magisters certainly don't spare expenses, do they? Ah, we got a lot of EXP for that. Ooh, there's a mace over here. Oh. Not bad. It's not better than mine, though. Now is not the time for a bath. Hey. It's not like stealing to take any of this stuff, either. Huh? I guess our characters don't really care about taking from these people. Ooh, pigskin gloves. They're, um, good. Oh, identifying glass. These gloves are good, but they're finesse-based, so I can't wear them. It's 11. Oh, yeah. Uh, me neither. You thought Rivalon was flat. 
Blood Rain skill book in this desk. Necromancer spell. Ooh. There's a painting of a knight on the wall. Over here. Let's see, I've got some letters and some notes. First letter. From the desk of her ladyship Dallas, right hand to the Bishop Alexander, son of the divine. To our brave troops in Fort Joy, be warned, a tedious, bothersome, but not altogether disorganized group of rebels calling themselves seekers have set their eyes on some of our sorcerers. They may or may not have facilitated the escape of at least two special ones, and you are forewarned to be on high alert. If any so-called seekers are found, they are to be delivered to my person directly for treatment I and only I may administer. Mistakes and missteps will not be tolerated. D. Letter number two. Madam, your techniques have proven most effective and true marvel. A true marvel. Odd that the Source King had this technology so long ago but managed to keep it quite secret. As to the technical matters, the monks do listen, but they are so listless and dull. They respond, but they do not engage. Would it not be possible, perhaps better, if they obeyed on their own accord? My mind races with the possibilities. Obedience through free will, a will shaped by the order itself. Then we might at last have the army the divine dreamed of. May his spirit rest in peace. Yours forever in service, Oravand. Hmm. And the last thing is a cautionary pamphlet. Sailors, scavengers, and, and fellow magisters, do not follow the light. There is no lighthouse in all of Driftwood and no friendly fire by which to sail. Midnight flames are a ruse organized by dwarven filth to lure you, lure you into their piratical trap. Dwarven Trust me, filth. I know... <laughs> Trust me, I know from whence I talk. Magister Yvette. Ah, uh, here's the um, little area we can go out to get that chest, though. I'm gonna do that. Oh, you fucking did it! Uh -huh. What a prick. There was a poison dart skill book for Geomancer. I... Mm -hmm. Sent it to you. And I sent you some paintings and stuff. Mm -hmm. I don't need all this junk. I think I'm going to put these letters down. Dallas, in her great wisdom, granted us a gift. A gift. A sacrament. A Ooh. In one. I judge Oravan himself is out there. Pay attention. Oh, a shame they become so docile. Regardless, where is he? Important, you know outside? Or to the outside the store here? We are of the divine. We where? I would never harm you. My you don't see him? Will bring you He's talking right now. Perfect will. Like at an oh, altar. There. there you go. Okay. I was I saw the guy standing in the middle. I was like, who's talking to him? But I was looking down there on that level my camera was all zoomed in. Oh. Yeah, I'm guessing we probably don't want to talk. We don't want to step right out the door. <laughs> Is there anywhere else to go? I heard you looked at everything else. So if I hold shift, I can see where they can see. And they wouldn't see us if we open the door up. Right. Um, we could probably sneak down, and then there's a door there that's not locked, and that's also out of their vision. It's like the opposite side up on top. And we can get into the large room that was over there, at least, to start with. And then from there, we could even continue around the rest of the balcony to, like, that little tower area. Hmm. 
I mean, <laughs> technically, we could like sneak right behind them, but I don't know how exactly that would work. Your source will be gone. I don't but think that's a good idea. No, probably not. Hundreds, Richly bound book he's reading from. You want to try this? All right. Do we, have, do we have a save? Yep, save in the game. The escape. Is that what we're doing right now? That's what popped up. <laughs> Shh. Oh, so Magister Yarrow gave us a key to let enter here. Yeah. Um, we learned a group of dissident magisters are called the Seekers, are helping sorcerers to escape. So I guess that's what we're looking for, is evidence of the Seekers. Mm -hmm. I wonder if those are the Seekers that we were talking to with that guy and stuff. Migo, or not Migo. That elf we freed and stuff. After you. There's nobody in here, so... Uh-oh. You just said sneaking that? failed. That sack of stuff move? Oh, I, I looked into it. Oh, okay. Ooh, shackles of pain for necromancer. 200 and some gold. Damn, look how rich you are now. Pretty rich. These paintings are all pretty valuable. Ooh, Magister's sword. Not bad for just a common item. See that? What? What? what the chest and the Iron Maiden in there? In this room? Uh -huh. I'm out of lockpicks. What are you doing? Eating them? Oh. I don't see any health for this door, so. All right, that's why I'm at. Like the chest was the same way. Hmm. Probably need to find What's... a key somewhere. There's a well out here. Oh really? Yeah. There's also a magister ranger. It looks like she's patrolling up here right now. But she wasn't up here before, so I knew we could sneak out. See what's going on with the well. Because we played Divinity One. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's go now then. Okay. Gonna click it or Jeez. uh just a crafting well, I guess. <laughs> mm. I don't think there's anything out here. We should move back in, I think. Yeah. She's still away right now. The divine would want the world free of Void Woken. So she stays down there for a while. There's like a metal crate out there. There's like a big drawbridge. I wonder if we could lower that. It's also a ladder. All right, she's coming back. Let's get out of here. <coughs> Is there a mechanism for the drawbridge out there? Um, probably. Yeah, there's, that a, leads, like, there's a wheel. 
That leads like out of this whole area and towards like the cave and everything. It says the hollow marshes. Okay. There's a what? There's a wheel. Yeah. Where? Just to the left of the entrance way to the drawbridge. Oh, on the inside of the wall? Oh, you're right. Yeah, yeah. And then there's also like a wall we could get up onto. Mm -hmm. Sneak around a little bit, but I don't really see anything like too terribly important up there. Also, we can get there from back. I count. Only we have the will to do what's necessary. God damn, there's a whole area up here. So you're out of lockpicks, you think that's the only reason you can't get that door open? Sorcerers are like the Divine's children. Think so. If you're harming them in here, we'll... Did you see this paladin guy over here? You're weak. Only we have the will to do what's necessary. Sorry, what was that? Did you see this paladin guy over here? Yeah, paladin cork. Yeah, I mean he seems pretty interested in the paladins. Go and tell your grandmaster that. Nice stuff. Everything to do with the paladins. Like he wouldn't be on the magister side. Yeah. The divine would want the world free of void. Should we get on these steps? Um. Yeah. Silent. Uh, monks. Do we have a save? <laughs> Do now. I wonder if this is the that door that we come up from the dungeon. You think so? Could be. Well, let's go look. So these monks are just cool with us? I guess. You don't want to try talking to them real quick? Oh. Yeah, this is the uh, main entryway. From outside with the, the closed gate and the magisters on the ah. guarding thing. What the hell are these? All right, I need to talk to a monk. All right. Okay. So when they say silent monk, they mean dead silent. <laughs> hey, yep. The creature before you stares with sightless eyes and leans from side to side like a puppet without strings. It's your thing. Mm, I know. That's making my skin crawl, but I find myself strangely fascinated. That's making my skin oh, crawl, damn it. but I find myself strangely fascinated. <laughs> that haunted look in its eyes. Whatever it was, it's in terrible pain. Okay. They're obviously not guards because they're just standing there. Yeah, this is a larger area than I was expecting to find. Yeah. Holy hellhounds, those dogs sound out for blood. I want to see what's down in this door, down these stairs. Yep, these are the holding cells. This is where we would have came up at. Oh, yeah. Yep. Doesn't seem so bad now. Huh? Ooh. 
down this hallway is like a boat tied up to like a dock. Where? Down this hallway over here. Okay, there's um, some magisters up ahead there, though. I see. <coughs> yeah, magisters. There's a kid named Han up here. Were we looking for a kid named Han? No. Sounds like he's going solo. There's only two magisters down there. Level yeah. level four. I'm not getting into that boat with you. The kid's level five. What the hell? <laughs> He's fine. Where'd you go? He's got more health than they do, yeah. Should oh, they are picking on him, aren't they? Should we do that? Maybe we should. Battle stomp skill book. I got that. Okay. What the flying hell? Karen, you said this way was clear. But, but that's what the log said, sir. And no one's all for us to be here. What is that? A kid like 12? Well, the log was wrong, you idiot. I hope for your sake no one will miss him. This is strictly a divine order matter, Longstocking. Very... Very strictly. Long stocking. A hey kid, come back. What the hell? He went out to hide. Okay. Some oil in a fire barrel. Woo! Man, I hate the magic armor thing sometimes. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna back up a bit now. Well, maybe. Hey, I was supposed to hit both of them with that. It's bullshit. I said I was gonna hit both. If all the monks didn't get involved, that's a good sign. Armor is way back up. What's that other thing that you're throwing? So like ice or something? Uh, I have, yeah, ice and fire. Wrong. I can't smoke smoke move is in your way. I want to. Oh. Oh, you're probably right. Though. That's probably why, actually.
a little bit annoying that we're um we both have to work on separate bars to get to the health can you stun Karen in any way not this round. Damn. Oh, I can't move because I'm crippled. Yeah. Oh. You know, a crippling blow might actually not be bad if that's what it does. If they can't move, because mm -hmm. stop people from chasing you around if they don't have any range. Hoping that would light everything on fire. Yeah. You still want me to knock her down? I don't need it anymore. Or not kill me before I got to heal myself. Son of a bitch. So, <laughs> the water bolt I shot cleared the poison first and then the fire one hit. Yeah. That sucks. Kill her. Yeah. Crit. Oh, did you see her flip around? Oh, hey, I think I heard your music, by the way, when you just killed her. Oh, yeah. Because you, you took, the like, cello. that cello. Got, yeah. Cool shield. Oh, yeah. And a dwarven staff. Send you the staff. Look at the shield. Ah, sweet. 
no more makeshift shields. Mm hmm. All right. Well, I think that's probably a long video there. Yeah. I'll have to talk to this boy next time. Yeah. Uh, where do you go? <laughs> I think he. I think he. Oh, just... he's just down the dock. Oh, okay. All right. So we'll go away now, and then we'll talk to him next time. Till next time.